Hi Pisceans, welcome to my channel. We're doing your weekly reading. This is the 6th to the 12th of November, exposing your soulmate's true feelings. Here we're going to look at the situation that you are in, and then we're going to see um, how your, you know, the true feelings um, of your soulmate. This is Scorpio season, so we're a uh, revelation of the truth, basically. What's hidden? Because Scorpios like to hide. I'm kidding. <laughs> so let's see what's going on for the Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Let's see. Here we go. Have your King of Pentacles can be an earth sign that you're connecting to. Businessman. Um, I always say this with the King of Pentacles. It's someone who gives an extra, extra to everything because they have a lot, you know. Um, or you can be doing this to the person, um, you know, spending time and then you can give even more. You know, like you're going to be very busy, but then you're going to be like, I can still, still do this for this person or, you know, they're doing that to you. Um, this is a very masculine energy and this is a person who's strong-willed. Um, very very confident also confident outside like this person can can come into a room and command the room Okay, but this is your energy also oh, yeah, You know if it's resonating that way, but it's it's like the presence of this person is um, Very strong and it's attractive because they know who they are What they want in life, you know, that's what I'm sensing here The one who was uh, giving extra, I think, took some time out <laughs> because they have the Four of Swords. So they're basically needing some time out. And I'm taking a break. It's like, if I put extra, it's like maybe someone here needs some time and some rest because it's like they can't give any more. Or they're waiting now for a result or an outcome. It's also meditative, meaning the person that you're con connecting with can be, you're not talking because they're going. They're thinking of some sort of like sorting their life, maybe to become the King of Pentacles. That's one thing. And then you have here the Piscean card, the Moon card, the feelings, transformation also with the Moon card. This goes through a phase. If you're connecting with an Earth sign or Earth energy over here, they stop because they're going through some sort of transi transition. Um, can be this is a change of heart though. This is when this, the person started to pull back. Someone here is pulling back now hiding they were expressive first before and now they're not expressive oh definitely hiding high priestess over here someone here found someone or no, no, not someone some information and then they kept it to themselves now this so everything changes because they found something and then basically you 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 went within or they went within because of whatever that is that you have found out the four of swords it's like i need a break here there's something that's not what it seems without the moon card and you found out about it and you're not talking to the person also whatever that is see not talking two of swords no communication right now deep analyzing i'm just saying this because that's a four and two over here so six of swords, someone might want to move out of the situation and sort their life. Someone asks a question and they don't, they don't reply. This is when someone is ignoring you already. Someone here is being ignored in the connection. Secrecy, research, stalking, and then finding out something that you didn't see before with the two of swords because it's a blindfolded energy over there. Ooh. And you have here the Queen of Swords, so this person now, or you, whatever that was found out, it can be an indication where, I told you, someone wants to move away, someone wants to keep their distance now. Queen of Swords is like, they're not going to play the game, they're not going to be in the area of like, oh, I'm going to be open, I'm going to still, you know, give more effort. The King of Swords, uh, the King of Pentacles is the one that gives effort, and the Queen of Swords now is cutting it down no games you know i know what you do i know what you did i know what you're hiding whatever that moon card is hiding because normally i don't see it as a secret but here with the high priest in the moon card that is a secret um and but someone cannot deal with that secret uh the omission is a betrayal from what i'm sensing here it's like even though it wasn't something big if you didn't tell me then that makes it a lie that makes it a betrayal that's a queen of swords there's no thin line of 
um, expressing himself. It's either you do or you don't. Yeah, so it's, this is this this energy now is damn if you do and then the other one that damn if you don't, right? So there's nothing that can be reversed because they know they know or you know what it is, and it can't be reversed right now. It um, things has to be addressed and communicated with the Queen of Swords, or else it's gonna lead to permanent cutting. The Queen of Swords will cut it. Okay, so by see, and I'm gonna continue this reading with how this uh, with exposing your soulmate's true feelings in the situation. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. Have a wonderful, wonderful week ahead of you guys. Bye.